so farming got buffed again but it didn't go back to normal exactly so i'm here to tell you the new meta in farming here on hypixel skyblock guys let's go ahead and jump into it right now let's go guys Alrighty, you guys so we're here on the island now now we're gonna go over a couple of items you're gonna want to make sure you go ahead and pick up before you start mining cocoa beans this is because if you want to reach that four to five mil per hour you're going to need these items there's no way around it but guys it's not that hard to actually acquire these specific items so to start we could go ahead by changing our pet from the blue whale to actually the elephant pet guys if you don't know what the elephant pet does and you don't know the most recent thing that happened to the elephant pet it actually got buffed in the specific thing about it that got buffed was actually the trunk efficiency from a max total of 50 farming fortune to over 180 farming fortune this alone has made farming back to where it used to be before the nerf before the dwarven mines as you can probably tell so guys i want to make sure you guys know it is super important to go ahead and pick up a elephant pet as soon as possible when mining cocoa beans next guys you're going to want to go ahead and pick up a cocoa chopper basically what this does it is the jacob's tool that you should be using when mining cocoa beans and a couple things you should remember when you are actually using this is to make sure you have efficiency replenish one telekinesis and some kind of turbo cocoa enchant on your cocoa chopper because this will maximize the efficiency you actually are getting while mining cocoa beans replenish is a must guys like i i will say that buy a replenish book they're like almost two mil on the ah but that is the specific tool you are going to need while mining cocoa beans next we're going to be taking a look at what you you should be wearing while mining cocoa beans there's nothing really to it other than you should be having a pair of light rancher boots i'm gonna go ahead and equip mine just like this and the speed you should be setting them at is about 150 guys just play around that number i like 150 i find it works best for me when i'm mining cocoa beans but this is all you need to make sure you're mining cocoa beans efficiently so now i guess what we should do is actually go test out a couple things with the cocoa beans i want to go ahead and test out turbo cocoa 4 against turbo cocoa 1 if you don't know there's a glitch to where you can't combine cocoa bean books so I want to make sure there's not too big of a difference there. And another thing I want to test out is actually if it's more efficient to craft the cocoa beans into replenish books rather than just selling them to the bazaar. So let's go ahead and hop into that and make sure we know what is going to make us the most money here on Hypixel Skyblock. Alrighty, you guys. So now you can see we have our farm right here. And then you can see kind of the layer we have out. It's not really that fancy, guys. It's literally just jungle wood and then three layers of cocoa beans. But guys, we're going to go ahead and now we're going to see what the angle we need to mine it is. So let's just go ahead and mine that. And you should be holding it at a diagonal angle like this and you should be able to get all the cocoa beans on the platform so right now guys i'm using the cocoa chop of four so we're just gonna go ahead and see how much we make per row and i'll go ahead and touch bases with you guys after Alrighty, we went ahead and got 53 enchanted cocoa beans from that one row but now let's go ahead and test out the turbo cocoa one on the next row let's go ahead and do that right now guys all right guys based off the data i just collected they are borderline the same i actually you're not gonna believe this but i got more with just the regular turbo coco one coco choppa than i did with the turbo coco four choppa so uh hi pixel why don't you fix coco choppa for the boys you know anyway so based off of my greater judgment guys it doesn't matter actually what turbo coco enchant level you have at least for now i would say it's better off to have the higher levels if you can get the higher levels but something tells me high pixel is not going to fix this now what i want to test is actually something very cool that we can go ahead and look into now i want to know is it more profitable just to sell the cocoa beans as is or if it's more profitable to go ahead and turn them into replenish books and then sell those for around two mil each so let's go ahead and see what we can get so the first thing we should go ahead and look up on the auction house is replenish books we should see how much they're going for right now so let's go ahead and look up replenish just like that they're going for around 1.5 mil which this is pretty low in my terms because i have seen them up to 1.9 even at 2.1 mil being the cheapest replenish book on the ah so now what we should probably do is go ahead and figure out how long it would actually take us to go ahead and make a replenish book and see how many of these we can bang out in one hour so let's go ahead and do that right now all right so i figured out it actually takes 50 seconds to go ahead and make it there and back that's the equivalent to one row of cocoa beans equals 50 seconds to harvest which yields 54 enchanted cocoa beans on average so if we go over to collections now and we see what it actually takes to go ahead and make a replenish book guys we are going to be looking at 16 enchanted cookies now what does it take to make enchanted cookies 
cookies great question guys we're gonna go ahead and now look over here and it takes two stacks of enchanted cocoa beans or in other terms 128 enchanted cocoa beans for one cookie and we're gonna have to go ahead and do some math now and see how many enchanted cocoa beans it takes for one replenish book so after some quick maths i went ahead and justified it takes 2048 enchanted cocoa beans to craft one replenish book so now what we can go ahead and do is divide that number by 54 and then multiply it by 50 seconds and then we will see how long it takes to make one replenish book let's go ahead and try that out right now all right so after a little bit of math i went ahead and found out you can make one replenish book in about 27 minutes and just to give you guys a little comparison to what you guys maybe a little more end game would be making i only have a level 77 elephant pet and my farming level is only level 26 right now so you guys with the farming level 60 and the farming level 50s i can safely say you guys will be making anywhere between two to three books per hour but more closer to three books per hour i would safely say because you guys would be maybe getting close to that 20 minute mark per replenish book so taking everything into consideration i think personally based off of the market price right now with the replenish books you higher tiered farming players could be making anywhere between four to five million coins an hour but let's not stop it there let's make sure we're not making a mistake and make sure that it's not more beneficial to just sell the cocoa beans straight up to the bazaar rather than crafting them into replenish books so to do this we're going to go ahead and check the prices of the cocoa beans right now if we go ahead and sell the enchanted cocoa beans we would be losing almost 20k because 128 enchanted cocoa beans only sells for 68,000. where if you just crafted them into enchanted cookies you can go ahead and make 82,000 per cookie maybe a little bit of a secret money making method there i don't know for you guys who made it this far in the video you're welcome maybe you can go ahead and try that make some cash there but like i said we could make around two replenish books per hour which is in total 4096 cocoa beans so if we go ahead and do 4096 cocoa beans divided by 128 we will be looking at 32 enchanted cookies there and if we go ahead and multiply that by 82,000, this is actually cutting it a little bit short that's around 2.5 million coins per hour so in total guys it is not worth to just sell your cocoa beans save them and craft them into replenish books so you can go ahead and make an extra 300k profit per enchanted book Alrighty, you guys i think we went ahead and debunked a couple of things here and i hope i answered pretty much every single question you had regarding cocoa beans if you guys could go ahead and show some support on this video make sure to go ahead and like and subscribe because it did take a while to figure all this stuff out but with saying all that guys i'll go ahead and see you in the next one i love you all and peace out guys have a great day